Everyone's gonna miss me when I'm gone When I'm gone, nobody's gonna miss me When I leave Nobody. Anyway, thank you guys so much. This is such a special show tonight. We do this every Friday. This is my first show back as well uh, from my paternity leave. That's right, with a P. It's, it is a word. Uh, paternity leave. I know, it's such a rare thing. Yes, it, it, and I put the P in petite, Pete. It's actually petite, Pete, paternity. Yeah. It's pe petite, 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 paternity program. Uh, but no, tonight's Chandler's last show. He's going. He's going off to college, and we're all just so we're so um, excited for him. I actually had to make some calls to get this to happen, but I actually uh, for tonight's show is so special that I had we got a celebrity to be here. It's pretty cool. I think he's gonna come in through the back because he doesn't want a lot of fanfare. So let me just go see if he's here and he's ready. Okay. Hey, um, are you are you ready back here, uh, Mr. Mr. Uh, Travolta? Cindy. Stevie! Oh, hey, everybody's John Travolta. Stevie! Hey, Mr. Travolta. Hey, 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 uh, <laughs> Mr. Connor. I heard that, uh, I, I heard that, uh, that Chandler's going back to school. It's great. Okay. Anyway, uh, Stevie! <laughs> I'm, I'm John Travolta. So, Mr. Travolta, um, you're here for Chandler's last day. Yeah, you know, I just, uh, Chandler's going off to college and, uh, just want to make sure that he gets off on the right foot. All right, that's John Travolta, everybody. <laughs> All right, yeah, that was a special. I really had to pull a lot of strings with that one. I uh, really I just had to make one call and pay like $5,000. The Cucaracha from the crowd, I love that, thank you. No, guys, it's still the time of year to donate. Every, for every happy hour, we don't ask anything. Uh, that for the beer and everything that's here um, Let's just go ahead and give give a hand to Walt and Elisa Burns for getting that nice food set up If you haven't yet, there's veggie burgers and dogs So they thought of everybody in the spectrum. So it's cool. We're just a high, we're happy to be here um, We got a great show tonight. So first up is Luke McLathery and then I was like McLathery, excuse me yeah. And then we have, um, then, yeah, then, and then we have um, some beer traps. And then um, Andy Pickett's going to be performing tonight with Warp Airty. So uh, we're really excited about that tonight. It, <laughs> it's the parody of War. Uh, no, anyway, uh, just don't forget to donate. Just reach in a little bit. Some of it goes to Chandler. Some of it goes to the band. Some of it goes to um, God. I'm just kidding. If you're listening, help. Help us and hear God. Anyway, uh, I didn't mean to be blasphemous there. But no, you really are. You're really supporting uh, what I think is the true heart of the, the uh, of society is art and music. And so just go and give yourself a little pat on the back for being here tonight and so for supporting that. Uh, yes, hug. Get a, a self-hug. That's in, And you can self-hug yourself to the top. If you call now with my eight-week program of self-love. That's right. Every day you give yourself a hug and every day you pat yourself on the back. For $59.99, you save me the money. You pat yourself on the back. It's a win-win deal. <laughs> <laughs> no. All right. Uh, so I think we're ready. Um, are, are we ready? Or, I don't know. Are you guys ready? Hold on. I think. Uh, do we have another celebrity appearance? I, I don't know. Hold on. I'm getting a call. This one's an interstellar call. Anytime. 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 <laughs> Anytime. <laughs> okay, that was Predator. Whoa, Predator made it here, guys. That's pretty cool. Oh my God. You, you really never know what's going to happen here on Friday night. It is a long, strange trip, guys, and uh, you're just really part of it. It's um, it, it's just really happy. We're good. Are you? I think we're all good. Anyway. Ladies and gentlemen, now it's time for the main feature of tonight's event, Slide Music by Luke McGuffin. Big cigars, hell, we we're about to make it to Mars. Nice new clothes, no more Eskimo. 
got your average Jones, your semi-pros, and a whole bunch of superstars. Granny's been cooking since 1945. Papa's been working every goddamn day of his life. No, it's not the same. No one can complain. You got your big old things, your tiny brains. Hell, I'm about to go insane. But sometimes you're broke. Life is but a joke. Spending nickels and dimes on something to smoke. And little bitty bags of coke. I've been smoking since 1999. I never graduated, but I seem to be doing just fine. No life ain't Lots of gas, fast taxi cash, and you always got plenty to eat. Oh, but it ain't nice living on beans and rice. Everybody around you just putting you down, ain't nobody treating you nice. I've been turnstile and drunk pile too. I've been railroaded, but I just had to get on through. No, life ain't hard. Mr. Travolta, we're so happy. He's got a personal jet and he just flew right into Lockheed and just, he, you know, um, he just wanted to say hey to his whole flight crew. They didn't want to go to the show for some reason, but they're missing out on a really, really great shoe. That was my uh, Ed Sullivan impersonation. Oh, there's a lot more where that came from, folks. You can just come by every Friday. We do this. Um, it's just so pu we're just so pumped to be kind of uh, having our finger on the pulse of the city and the music scene and art and culture and, and music and you're all part of that by being here by supporting and so I just challenge each and every person in this room not only to create something from your heart something that means something to you but also to go and support others who are doing that exact same thing so um, that's really where it, where it comes down to as a culture and you too can subscribe and hit like below and all your dreams will come true that's why I'll send you a self dressed damn devil up to your house that says dreams come true <laughs> uh, no I'm, I'm just saying I just want to give a shout out to Luke he's got a really great album you gotta check it out it's on Bandcamp Bandcamp I got SoundCloud albums. so you got I know SoundCloud, SoundCloud. okay but it's called uh, Life Ain't Hard and you just gotta check it out on SoundCloud um what and good morning oh and he's got good morning don't forget about those one called good morning hello hello that's the guy that just performed. His name's Luke, and you can check him again probably anytime he plays a lot. He's just doing this as, as a career, and, and you just gotta give a shout out to dudes like this. I mean, they're just busting their butt every day to to make it in this world, and it's not an easy thing to do in the, in the art and, and music scene. They don't really make it easy for you. So, uh, big shout out to you, there, Luke. Really easy for me. Well, you know, you're a very talented guy, so <laughs> the, your path has been laid before you with your heart and soul. Uh, let's go ahead and give a, a shout out to the man of the day, uh, Chandler Burns. Let's give him a little. I just want to. I just want to say how how much of a pleasure it is to have worked with this guy. Siberian traps. You're on. You're called on the stage. Siberian traps. You're called on the stage. Um, you know. I just want to give a shout out to how how great it's been and, and fortunate I am to have watched this this young man grow into a a man and babies all grow up. Uh, I told myself I wouldn't do this. Uh, but babies all grows up and I'm just so pumped to see him we, we go off to college and do great things in this world and um, it, it, Walt and Elisa I don't know where you're at probably cooking some birds or something but here's the Walt I see a Walt here's the anyway you did a great job with this kid and I'm just so thankful to uh, be part of his life and we, he's always got a home right here you know and that's what they say is that um, your home is where you love and so um, you may travel the whole world, but your heart is always in, in, in Fort Worth, and so uh, you're, we're always with you on your journey. So, cheers to you, Chandler, and, and College Bound Life. Let's just give a one more shout out to my boy, everybody. I don't want to get too mushy. 
but I just I, re I didn't realize how much time I had to kill between the set breaks. So, uh, does Predator want to say anything? I don't know. He, he, I think he's I think he's already chilling. Um, want some candy? Um, I, that was from Predator 2, starring Danny Glover. I don't know if you saw that one, but uh, but he's like if like if Lethal Weapon like got supernatural. Riggs, there's an alien in here. One one day two a time at Riggs. I got a damn alien in my pants. That was that was uh, Danny Glover. So anyway, uh, Cyberian Traps, please start setting up your gear, Cyberian Traps. Uh, anyway. <laughs> Uh, that that was just I, this is kind of my passive aggressive um, <laughs> host getting nervous. Hey, um, let me just see if, if anybody's back here. Hey guys, are y'all back here? Is, can you hear me that predator mask right there? <laughs> the, predator, the predator mask. I don't think I. Oh wait, I didn't mute it. Okay, guys, uh, predator's back. Oh my god. Any What the hell are you? What the hell are you? Anyway, so uh, I watched too many movies as a kid, and so it just kind of keeps coming out of my, quote, comedy. Uh, I really just kind of do this in the mirror at home in my RV, and uh, I'm just, like, talking to myself and making myself laugh. But if you laugh, then I'm like, whoa, hey, then maybe we got, we got something here. Uh, I'm just going to give a, another shout out to um, Elisa Burns for the, the for the thoughtfulness in having vegan options for everybody. Thank you so much for that. We we live in a, a, a we live in a modern world, and you know we got to have options for everybody. I'm sorry, there's no bottled waters. Sorry, there's no bottled waters. If you're thirsty, I have some water in my cup, and I'll share it with you. It's pH 8.5. So if you're not down with the high pH content, then don't really drink it because it might make you a little sleepy. No, seriously, uh, Crazy Water has lithium in it. I didn't know this, but so and uh, you will have the deepest dreams of your life. Okay, you like to have deep sleep. Zoom in. Do you do you like to have deep sleep? Do you like to sleep through the night and have a huge bubble of drool at the end of the morning? Do you like to have the craziest dreams of your life? That's why you can subscribe to my high alkaline water regimen. I will send you water and you'll send me tons of money. <laughs> <laughs> Did you zoom in the part where I said money? Okay. All right, cool. We'll have to like put a bunch of E's on the end of that. Oh wait, we're at the library. I got to spell right. It's wise. Money. You give me the money, I'll give you the wise later. Okay? I don't know why, but you just give me the money. Anyway, so speaking of giving money, just deep, deep guys in your pockets and just come up with a couple bucks to throw back here. All the money goes to the bands, and we don't ask for anything. Raw donates to beer because they like to support the arts. You like to support the arts. We like to support the arts, and also we like to support our local scene. Uh, coming up, there's a lot of great shows. Um, this next band coming on, I don't know if you're you're uh, got your your ear to the tune of the beat of the hit to the streets, but uh, <laughs> this these guys, Siberian tra tramps, traps. Sorry, they're not tramps. They're not Roman. They have homes. We are tramps. They have. <laughs> sorry, damn it. I told myself I wouldn't do that. That's kind of my own thing at home. I just call them the tramps, and I'm just I think it's anyway. Uh, they have a really great they have a really great album and it's called Indicator and you can get it on vinyl in this room right over here. Boop, 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 boop. Check your bank account. I know it's Friday. I know you just got paid. Please buy it. Uh, now that was the robot that we uh, paid to work here that also looks like that mop that guy with the dirty mop on his face. Uh, anyway. <laughs> Um, there's a lot of things you can do to support the local scene. One is donating money to to the jar back there. Two, you can buy merch. Hey, you go to shows, you buy a shirt, you buy a button. Uh, hey, you know, another thing you can do. Listen, okay, this is a huge one, guys, and this is my little thing. I just, I want more people to do it. And that's what's so great about this, this Dream Life Happy Hour is we, we have a concentrated listening environment and we want you to listen. And, and really, as a musician or as a songwriter, that's the best thing you can do. That's that's better than paying any money. It's just to pay attention to us and listen to what we have to, to express. And Preach it, sometimes, Peter. sometimes if you just if you're just in the room and you're there to talk, you can just go outside and do that. You know, nobody wants to hear that shit. <laughs> We're here trying to listen to music. So if we try to talk, I will kick you out. Okay, so nobody gets to talk to anybody tonight. I'm watching. Okay, like a hawk. And also, you only get three. You only get three beers. If I see you with the fourth one. 
You, you don't want to. You don't want to go there. You, okay, ma'am. Um, if you brought your own beers, that's one thing. You do your thing. But uh, we just really try not to promote drunkenness, especially with free beers. We gotta have kind of regulation. So this is a a, a paid advertisement by the um, Mothers Against Drunk Driving organization. I'll give a shout out to them. Uh, we don't donate anything to them, but we do like to not contribute to drunkenness and driving. So let's just give that, that shout out. Also, as a new father, I'd like to give a shout out to mothers all over the world. I hold you up everything every day. I hold you up and the, it just and the awe I am. Inspired by women and mothers everywhere for what you do and what you did to create life and nourish it. Um, so this one just goes out to all the moms, and this one goes out to all the babies with no moms. Babies all over the world that don't have moms, boys and girls. You didn't know that you had a mom until you were born. Andy Pickens at the door. Andy. Somebody get the door for him. It's just a star-studded event. Everybody's coming out. We are here in celebration of Chandler. Babies all grows up. He's going to college. Babies all grows up. <laughs> See. Oh my gosh, guys, hey, thank you so much for being here. Thanks for stopping by. Um, I don't know if you've ever gone on a big adventure, but I feel like this is this is Hobbiton, and, and my boy is Frodo, okay? I just feel like he's about to go on the greatest adventure of his life. Yes, and yes, and I, it's all, it's, yeah, the Shire, thank you. Yeah, the Shire, excuse me. Anyway, yeah, yes. Shire! Oh my gosh, the ring rates are after him. Everybody get out of here. I don't believe in ring rates, okay? I don't believe in that. That's, you know, that's dark magic, okay? My pastor told me not to believe in that. Um, no, anyway, uh, there's so many books in here, guys. I just can't help but just feel the knowledge that is just seeping in here. And you too can feel the knowledge. With my eight-week program, you will feel the knowledge. <laughs> Click like below if you liked that joke, or just you know maybe probably already gotten onto something else you know like cats, like ba you know babies crying, the, and the cats patting their little faces, you like the mixer of the two videos together. Yeah, uh, just check my videos later. I have a bunch of them now. I got this cat. Now that I have a kid, I've just got this cat. I just keep letting them be cute together. I'm just kidding. Uh, I like to give a shout out to Gracie over here. She's a great big sister. Okay, everybody out there in the internet world, you gotta look out for her. Gracie Powers is gonna be big someday. Uh, anyway, uh, everybody at that outside that got rained on, I just want to let, let you know that. In a way, I think God kissed you with some of his men. I can take that. How long have you not been pregnant? Oh, girl. There's so many Peters. We we actually have so many Peters. And extra Peters. Really, there's it, there's a Peter everywhere you look in this town. I mean, you can't really walk into a place without two people, probably, statistically. It, thank you. It, and that is coming from a, a certified. Uh, um, teacher of the youths. <laughs> yeah, the youth. The youths of tomorrow are being molded by the next performer's um, beautiful mind. So, um, another shout out, just going out to all the, the dads in the world. Okay, everybody in the room is a dad. Just one love. All right, just one love to you and, and being a dad. It's it's not easy. It's not easy, you know, um, standing by while mom nourishes this life. You know. <laughs> <laughs> just like, I'm hey, trying to do whatever I can, okay? Oh, you want me to get out of here? Okay. Everybody's trying to sleep. We gotta sleep. I, and I'm just hype. Have you ever been just really hype around a sleeping baby? It's hard. You know? He's just like, why are you so hype? I work at a coffee shop. You don't understand yet. But dad is a weirdo. Okay. Uh, <laughs> no, but it, it's just, it's super cool. Um, we're just having dreamy babies Bustle. here in the Fairmount Baby Library. Fairmount Baby Library. Oh, this is the Fairmount Baby Library. It is a baby library. Yeah. I know it is. I'm just gonna. Uh, oh my gosh, guys! Now that I'm sitting next to, to Peter Marge, I can play this song. <laughs> I'm like pointing down my face for it, and I was like, I'm feeling on my chest for a while.
My youths. It's from the youths. My youths. We all do it for the youths. Um, if you haven't already, get yourself a free beer back there. You only get three. Okay, we're watching. All right. Uh, also, if, if you have other things you'd like to partake in, please make sure you just do it uh, in the safety of our backyard uh, smoking bin. Uh, I'm just wondering. Uh, you must be wearing a blazer, though. That's the only rule back there. It's all jazz. It's kind of weird. Uh, but you have to have a blazer. Um, if you haven't already, just just open the paper and just go to a local show and just you know give them your attention and your love, because that's that's the, the freest thing you can do. It's just love, okay? And you know they say that that it makes the world go round. I don't know. I've heard, okay? I've had a lot of good experiences with love, and also had some bad ones. Told myself I wouldn't talk about those tonight, but here I am. Uh, there's so many ways that you can show your love, and um, one is smiling. Hey, that's a good way. That's a good way to. Just, it's a good start. You just smile every once in a while. Um, you know, hey, a hug. You know, it's kind of weird to just go and hug people though, because I, I recommend that you don't try it. Chandler tried it the other day, and this dude just wouldn't let go. Uh, <laughs> turns out it was actually a payphone, and Chandler ate some acid. No, I'm, just playing. <laughs> I'm just playing though, that was me. Uh, that was me, I was thinking about Chandler, because he's my boy. But that's, that's the weirdest part of that story. Oh hey everybody, uh, it's, the party just gets better and better as people walk in. That's right, you too can support. If you're at home, go ahead and get on that phone and call. Our operators are standing by all night to take your donations. Um, I have all of a sudden Jerry Lee Lewis, and this is a telephone, okay? Okay, everybody, call in right now. I don't even know what he sounds like, because he's just so, that's a dated reference. Most of the people in here are probably like, who the hell are you talking about, Jerry Lee Lewis? Now, if, you, if I'd have said Bob Hope, everybody would have been like, oh, shit, hell yeah. Bob Hope, that's my dog. <laughs> Anyway, no, it's kind of cool, you know, to be uh, one of the guys that that was, um, you know, around then in the telethon. I always wanted a, a dreamy life to have a telethon and just stay up all night. And we just, like, have this live feed. And everybody's just like, oh, my gosh. And I bring a bunch of coffee. And we're like, how much can we raise? And we got one of those little numbers that's, like, never moving. But it would move because I think that everybody in this person helps move our souls and hearts in the right direction towards art and music. And so, uh, I'd like to just uh, just say before this next band comes on that uh, thank you. Thank you for being here for Chandler's party. Thank you for supporting local music. Thank you for uh, purchasing something in the gift shop. Thank you for, uh, you know, wearing t-shirts with other people's faces on it. Maybe it's your favorite artist. Maybe it's my face. I don't know what kind of shirts he got. Um, but anyway, thank you so much um, for, uh, for being here. We're getting, we're getting going. We're getting going here. It sounds starting to sound like it's getting comfortable. Okay. Well, the drummer's not here yet. Okay, well, 
we folks this is just another this is another example of how the music scene works and, and you just get to be right here and be part of it so uh, just just you know let us do our thing okay so back off Sorry, I yelled at y'all earlier and said back off. Okay, I was just kidding. I promise. It was just, it was just my way of doing things. <laughs> All right, so this next band's got a, a new album out. It's on vinyl. It's a Dreamy Life record out of vinyl. And it's right here in this other room. It's called Indicator, okay? And uh, it's pretty phenomenal, okay? I, I'm in love with these guys. They don't know it, but I have a little shrine at the house. And... Um, I got a bunch of mouse traps and I painted their faces on each one. And it, they have little Russian hats. It's kind of cool. I bet it's not Russian. It's, it, it's, it's just kind of it, the, that peninsula of ice and animals. Uh, so this is also brought to you by Discovery Channel's Planet Earth series. You can pick up a copy at your local library. Uh, we don't have a copy here. So maybe not your exact local library. Maybe the one that's not so close. Maybe the one on Camp Bowie or something. Or maybe Hewlin. Are y'all closer to there? I don't know. Uh, but anyway, uh, if you're if you're not in a rush, we got free beer back here. That's right. I said free beer. Watch out, alcoholics. They're not. They're not. You can't go to town. Okay. This isn't a freaking you know buffet. You only get three. And that's enough. If that's not enough for you, then you got a problem. This goes out to all the people that don't have problems, okay? Uh, responsible drinking is a thing still. Um, I, I'd like to just give a shout out to people that, that you know, are learning to keep it cool in public, okay? Thank you for keeping your cool in public. I'm not a bartender and I never will be because I don't want people to uh, blame me for getting drunk. <laughs> and I don't like deal. I don't even like dealing with them. I go to, I go to sleep at 10 o'clock and I get, hey man, hey. <laughs> she knows what's up. Thank you so much for being here. Um, these guys are getting, they're getting ready. I'm getting a little stir crazy. We got five minutes till stir time. <laughs> My heart's racing. I don't know what's supposed to happen. They said this would happen in health class when I became a man. <laughs> So hey, uh, are, are you here for the show? Or? Yes, sir. Are you trying to get out of here? You know, right? oh, no, sir. That's right, folks. People are excited. They're just excited for Chandler on his journey into another another part of his being a man. Um, if you too can journey to the other side of being a man with my four-week program, you will be a new man. That's right. This just in. In a world where people are subscribing to stuff, Darth Vader is alone in a world of subscribers. Too many people are subscribing. <laughs> hey, is um is Predator still here? I th I heard that the Predator was in the building. It's hard to tell. He's kind of invisible. Um, anytime, anytime. I'm not Darth Vader. Do you know? Uh, do you know where Arnold is? Arnold back there? What the hell are you? What the hell are you? It's so crazy how Predator came here. You know, he's just checking out the jungle. He's just a dude that his little plane crashed, okay? And we just start blasting him. He rolls into this whole, like, drug deal gone bad in the jungle. I mean, poor Predator. What if, what if, he, what if he rolled into the Dreamy Life Happy Hour on a Friday night? I think he'd have a lot better experience. And that's why you two can have a great experience if you just come on down here. We're still partying. We're going to be here till 11. <laughs> Luckily, Dad's got the day off tomorrow, but Dad's never have a day off. So let's just go ahead and <laughs> give a shout out to Dads doing that, doing that deed. And I'd like to give a shout out to Moms, okay, for that miraculous thing that you did to create a human. Holy cow, okay, unbelievable. Yeah, it's just a, a family environment here. It's a family atmosphere, and you two can be part of that family for only twenty nine ninety nine a month. You can be part of the family that brings you such hits as Loving you each day is more beautiful because you're beautiful. And 
Loving you isn't easy because you're ugly as shit. Okay. He's yes. like five minutes away. Okay, we got it. We got. We're going down to traffic five, and we're gonna we're gonna visual on the drummer's vehicle. Yes, we're traveling down I forty five right now. This guy's flying like a bat out of hell. Do you have a visual? Chopper two. Do you have a visual on the drummer? He's almost the dreamer life happy hour. We're calling the cops. That's right, because this is off the chain, folks. This dreamy life happy hour is just. It's just a killer event with all kinds of cool stuff. You never know what's going to happen next. You know, at any moment you could have a free beer in your hand. At any moment you could find yourself on a mosquito-ridden back porch with no light. At any moment. Oh, Predator actually does parties, okay? And if you want to be part of that, you can uh, just by calling uh, one eight hundred Predator Stomp. It's actually his little like oh no, PredatorStomp.com, but it's one eight hundred Predator. If you want to. You do the math, okay? Predator does the rest. As long as the check bounce doesn't bounce, Predator will do whatever you want. He can do the splits. He can do. Uh, he make he makes cupcakes. It's real weird. Yes, it's so weird. They they have human skulls, little little skulls. I have a question for you. Sure. What happens when an unstoppable predator eats an inedible object? What? I don't know. Oh. It's just, it's like, what happened, you know, could God make a rock to make a room to lift, you know? Oh, it's going to make, it makes a crystal. Okay. He can make a crystal with his atomic properties. <laughs> what kind of crystal? It's a freeze-dried skull inside of quartz. It's crazy. It's just like... Alright, I could do this whole predator thing all night, guys, but it's a little weird and people just kind of look at me funny and I'm like, damn right, it, I gotta keep it professional. Down. Thanks so much for being here. You get three free beers and you donate. Don't forget, all the donation goes to the band. We don't ask for anything but your attention and your money. Is that too much? Is it too much to ask? I need you to actually watch my dog this weekend. I need uh, some time away from that mother. He's pissing all over my pants. I blame the piss on my pants from the dog, but really it's because I had too much kombucha. Speaking of, this goes out to kombucha. Gotta, gotta love that mother culture. So Mike, tell us how long you've been playing with uh, Sabrina and Trent. Uh, a while. Y'all you know, just went on a recent tour. How was that? Weird, wild? It was pretty cool. Uh, Seth got punched in the face. Attention Seth, you want to tell us a little bit about that? Yeah, totally. Tag the face. Hey, camera guy, just pan over. Come on. I mean, it's not really like a glorious tale. I mean, it's zoom, in, zoom into him. He's telling a story. I just got punched in the face by a random stranger. No, no, no. And how'd that make you feel? Pain. <laughs> Now, did you, and then afterwards, I was mad, and then after I got over being mad, I was really the video. <laughs> Did you get anything stolen? Yeah. No. Nope. I just okay. got punched in the face. This was a random act of violence. Yeah, he almost got a guitar stolen. I didn't read about that. That was a different scenario. That was, that was the same city. Different, different city. Check, 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 check. His feet should be almost here. There he is. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen! I love you! Ready? We love you. Oh, okay.
Heard the generator going. Oh my god, the Predator's here again. What the hell are you? Uh, Predator, I thought you exploded yourself in a, a nuclear blast from your wrist. Want some candy? Predator does all kinds of weird stuff, folks. You, isn't that funny? I just wonder myself uh, where, where, how John Travolta and the Predator are even connected. Like, who thought of this shit? Oh yeah, Dreamy Life Records. That's right, Dreamy Life Records spinning the hits. Excuse me for the S word. Um, we try to keep it family friendly here. But for the racks and the stacks of the best on wax, Dreamy Life. Subscribe below. Make sure you hit like and, and check out everybody in the world that's making music. I'd like to say good morning to all the people in Japan. Uh, um, Gingi Deska. Skoshi Nihongo. Anybody? We're on this reverb. I hate this. I feel like I'm in space. Oh my god! Oh my god! Hey, hey Mr. Travolta, uh, were you gonna come back for an interview? Maybe he'll do an interview oh with god, us later. No, I'm sorry, I gotta go. Thank you, bro. <laughs> Dude, it's never a dull moment. Oh, <laughs> it's never a dull moment here at Dreamy Life Records. Let's just give a shout out to Robbie Rucks. Everybody's always, everybody's always, everybody's always saying, hey, um. I'm friends with, I'm, everybody likes to say, man, I'm friends with Robbie. Um, is it cool if I, and you're just like, oh, you know what? You know what? Everybody's cool with Robbie, okay? In fact, I don't know one person that could possibly dislike Robbie. You know, like, hey, of course he's cool with everybody. He's Robbie Ruggs. Are you fucking kidding me? No, seriously, people always try to pull that shit at, at Avoca, too. They're like, hi, um, I know Gerald. And you were just like, no, you don't. You can't even say his name right. Just want a little shout out to Avoca Coffee. And if you don't know about them, you should check them out. Anyway, that's just a little uh, shameless plug there for the company that pays me. Uh, I wonder who pays Predator. According to the Predator uh, like whole storyline, is that this Predator that came and dealt with Arnold was just a baby. He was just a little, he was like a little minion, okay? And he got, he got off, his little scout went off, off the path, off the beaten path, this little spaceship. Ended up in the, the Colombian jungle. Uh, we don't know how, but I'm telling you right now, he was not expecting to see the crew that rolled in there, okay? A minigun and Predator are not friends. That's the only thing that makes this, this green blood come out. Hey, Stephanie. 
Thank you for being here. You missed my Predator impression, but if you stick around long enough, you might see another one. Good to see you. Welcome. And there you get three free beers, okay? We're watching. All right, so um, everybody, every, I say that to everybody, uh, you too can get three free beers. You just come on down, bring your mom. Everybody's mom shows up and they bring kids and there's dogs and puppies and babies. And sometimes Chris Walden shows up. You know the guy that we all love? There he is. Can we get a zoom in? Can we get a zoom in of Chris? Hi. Hi. Hey, Chris. Hi, everybody. His, his mom's super proud because she created an angel one day. <laughs> um, so uh, you can check out music like this every day here in, in Fort Worth. There's always a show. There's always a way that you can go and support your scene, rep your click, uh, re uh, holler at your boy, uh, you know, just, you know, roll with your click and your peeps. <laughs> And, and your crew, you gotta have your squad goals on point and your street life uh, lit AF. Keep it 100. I like to I like to have my my lit sequence and uh, rockets always lit AF. <laughs> Just like America, when the rockets red glare, don't you dare stare. And speaking of staring, uh, nobody's in here. Stare. We've officially scared away everybody out of the room. Um, this is something I was afraid of. This is attracting me here, Oh, I'm so glad you're here, Luke. Thank you so much. Uh, this is just part of what we do here. Um, I, I wrote this little this little card for Chandler. It says, one love, Chandler. Aw. One love. Yeah. And I, and I, I like to read it real quick. <clears throat> <sighs> Dear Chandler, all the days went by as you grew into a man before my eyes. I can't believe you're going off to school. You're such a dude that's really cool. Your hair flies up in the air like Cosmo, Crane Air. And someday you'll come back to us, a man, with a new vision and a new plan. Off to college you may go for now, but in our hearts you'll stay sweet and sound. This is your boy Pete saying one last thing. Wrap it up, man. <laughs> Woo! Thank you so Thank much. You, oh, Thank you, Peter. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, that was from my boy Chan, and I, I'm just so proud of him. Chan, Chan. I never thought at 33 years old to be paired up with an 18-year-old with some kind of weird vision, but the two of us have been a, a, a pretty, pretty uh, viable combo. And I'm just, peace, peace. I think a little, I'm losing an arm today, but I'm losing a bro. And off to the world, and he's gonna go out there and do special things in Tennessee, Tennessee, Tennessee. Ow! There ain't no place that I'd rather be. Baby, won't you carry me back to Tennessee? Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. That was my uh, Tennessee moment, brought to you by Tennessee Slam and the Tennessee Poking and the Tennessee Dan. <laughs> There's nothing. All things happen in Tennessee. You try to just keep it, keep it on the DL. What happens in Tennessee stays in Tennessee. Yeah. Okay. That's where my parents are from, Chattanooga, Tennessee. Oh, yeah. What about you? Oh, you're from Texas. Yeah. Okay. Well, God bless you. Uh, <laughs> There's so many things that can happen in a live show, folks. So many weird, wild, zany things. So many just actors in play. Uh, it's just, it's a miraculous thing, this music. This thing we call music. Creating a sound in the instantaneous moment in time. We're really just sharing cosmic energy here. And, um, and some people can do it better than others. And some people got a gift of making beautiful things. Some people got a gift. What's the Wi-Fi? Talk nerdy to it's me. It's called Talk Nerdy to Me. N E R D Y. <laughs> Why? Because we love you, asshole. <laughs> Who are these That's right. Seven Eleven employees. Who are these people? That was my ju that was my um Junior Seinfeld. Actually. Who are these people? You dropped your thing. I think I dropped a thing. Actually, if Smurfs knows, hey, where's Grover? I think that motherfucker just dropped a turd. What happens when puppets fart? What? Somebody gets a handful of fart. <laughs> Thank you so much, everybody. Thank you. There's so many more where that came from. <laughs> There's so much. You can just get all these kind of jokes just here and any night on Friday night. Welcome. There's three free beers back there, but you got to be responsible. Okay, so we just really want you to... um. Just 
give a shout out to your clique. You know, tell them what's up on Friday night. Tell them about Dreamy Life crap. Cra I almost said crappers. I'm thinking about that dirty diaper they get to change when they get home. Got a lot of crap waiting on me. That kid is a crapper. Uh, in fact, uh, the other day he came to pound and gave me three. I'm swearing. He got so. It, it, I, I got some more, but I, I just I forgot them right now. But what was that? A lot of <laughs> Predator's back. Yeah. Want some candy? Want some candy? Want some candy? Anytime. Anytime. What are you? Anytime. Well, I, I, Predator only seems to know a couple uh, one-liners there. I don't, I don't really know where he's going with his whole thing. Who invited him? I don't know, but Predator is welcome to any show. I love Predator. I honestly think he gets a bad rap because, I mean, when you're met with gun, when you're met with gunfire, and all you're trying to do is collect some skulls and, and just study some anatomy of, the, of whatever you're at, land on some weird, you land on some weird, you know, place. You're like, who the fuck are these guys? Seriously, who the fuck are these guys? Uh, and they start shooting at him. I mean, come on, get, you know, he's just a scout. He's just a lonely little predator scout. He's got big ass predator mom and daddy at home. Wonder where he's at. He ended up in our. Cameron world. and Chris, you want to get back over here? Cameron and Chris to the quarter stage. Inch cable. Quarter inch cable. Also, Peter. Dingy <laughs> Reed. Christopher Walter. Cameron. Welcome to the show. The Friday night show that everybody knows. Uh, you want to do a little quick check of your mic? Test, 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 test. Uh, test. Uh, um, who just did that? Uh, somebody on the left? Andy. I heard that. <laughs> who invited a panther in here? He's farting all over the place. <laughs> Welcome to the Panther City, also known as Fart City. No, no. Way. Actually, no. It's Farty Town. No, Funky Town. Keep full with Farty. Why is it so farty? Because we got Gus's fried chicken, we got barbecue, we got all kinds of shit just making people fart all over the place. And you go over to Avoca and you just finish it off in the bathroom. Uh, I know. I cleaned it. Anytime. Oh, what does Predator have to say about that? So Predator, do you take down some public toilets? And it's on. <laughs> That's right, folks. This is just a little sample of what you can experience in the dreamy life when you're living the dreamy life. Some people have said that the dreamy life has helped. Some say the dreamy life helps, some say it hurts. Whatever. We don't know what your regularly scheduled programs are. Just do a quick shout out real quick to all the people who help eat the food. It's all the people that help drink the beer tonight. You do get three free beers. We're watching, okay? Everybody here, especially if you're not 21. We're watching you. We're so happy you're here. When did you live in the dream and life? Just don't know what's left or right. Live in the dream and life. We invite you to get plugged in. Get yourself plugged into the local scene. You are tonight. You're plugged right on in. It's local. You're about to experience something really special. And that's a communal effect of good music and a good environment with good people. Don't forget to donate, guys.
guys, we do have a bucket back there that's got some money in it. Uh, have some Come beers. And get your love. All the music, all the money goes to the music, the, the, the musicians that are performing here tonight. And you can, you at home too, can donate by sending money to Dream Life Records at 1310 West Avenue in your own Phantom Mountain community, Fort Worth, Texas, 76104. That's Panther Pete just telling you to support your local music scene and art scene. Do what's right within your blood and your bones. By E.T. Phone Home. And to all the predators out there, quit being weird and haunting people with your weird violence, okay? Don't be a predator. Just don't do that anymore. This is the one that that effect.
anyway, uh, no, just thank you so much to War Party. Thank you to Andy Pickett. Thank you so much to Cyber and Trance. Thank you so much to Luke McClathy. Let's just hear one more time for the music that you just heard. Okay, I'm talking about, let's talk about Braveheart type yelling here. Okay, really? Ah! Yeah! Right. We all have the freedom, okay, that Braveheart was speaking of. We have the freedom to be who we want. We have the freedom to where we spend our energy. And you just had the freedom tonight to spend your energy with local art and music. So just love yourself and give yourself a pat on the back for that. This one goes out to all the dreamers and the doers of things. Uh, Chandler, I just want to quote a little, uh, just send out with a little Aristotle quote. Uh, the, the roots of education are bitter. It's going to suck. You're, they're going to toil it away every night. The roots of education are bitter, but the fruits are so sweet. So I just want you to know that you got a long road to hoe, big dog, but we're, real, we're rooting for you, and we're proud of you, and uh, we love you. So cheers to Chandler, and cheers to Dreamy Life Records. This is Panther Pete. Saturday night. Good night. Thank you so much. Love you, Peter. Peter is the best. Oh, 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 oh,